Hello everybody and welcome to VCE French at Hampton Park. My name is Madame Eat um, and this is Natasha Stonard. Um, she is our Languages Domain Leader for 2020 at HPSC and um, she'll be walking you through what VCE French looks like um, at Hampton Park. So Tash, you can take it away. Let's take a closer look into French. There are over 275 million French speakers. It is the main language for over 29 countries. It is the second most widely spoken language in Europe. It is in the top two languages spoken within the model UN. And it is estimated that by 2050, it will be the language most spoken worldwide. Finally, Melbourne contributes to the French language and culture as it has over 120 French businesses. Why would you want to study French? Well, being able to understand and communicate in a second or even a third language is a really big milestone and it can also be a really good feeling. It can help strengthen your intellectual ability, it improves your first language and it can provide really strong opportunities. Some of those opportunities include career advantages, more education choices and it can lead to higher paying jobs. We also can't forget that the export trade is essential for the survival of all countries. Therefore, knowing French means you can have a significant advantage for the future. Within French, there are several opportunities for students to engage and participate in student-led programs to help enhance their knowledge and understanding of the culture. There is French United Nations where students will work together in teams to research and represent a country within the United Nations and provide information on the given issue. This year's topic is fighting climate change. Another student-led program is the French Café, where students will collaborate together to manage and organise their own café. Furthermore, Hampton Park students and teachers were given the opportunity to visit French countries overseas and engage in local activities. In 2012, students were able to visit France and in 20, 2017, students were able to visit New Caledonia. Students were able to attend regular classes in a French public school. They visited local attractions and they had experienced a new way of life which opened their views of the world. Many students wonder if they have enough experience and practice to undertake French in VCE. Well, it's easy. The minimum recommended number of hours is 200. Each course is worth about 75 hours. There are six courses from year eight to 10, which can contribute to the hours. Therefore, it will be easily achievable to meet the minimum number of hours. However, if you were late to start French, you can still easily meet the requirements by partaking in at least three courses to reach the 200 hours. It's never too late to start. To get into VCE French, there are two options to follow. Option one is starting French in year seven with the taster course, then continuing in year eight with elementary classes, year nine intermediate classes, and year 10 advanced classes, finally starting your VCE journey in year 11 with units one and two. The second option is the acceleration program, where you can start the advanced course in year nine and begin VCE units one and two in year 10. Personally, I recommend option one as you will be able to develop and increase your French capacity within each course because some content will overlap with some areas and it will be easier to continue adding to your understanding. Don't forget that if you want to choose the acceleration program, you must have met the prerequisite of 200 hours and same goes for option one. While studying French, you will explore the topics of family, giving advice, holidays, routines, future, French history and many others. Each unit will consist of three sacks, interpersonal, which is speaking, interpretive, which is reading, writing and listening, and presentational, which can be either speaking or writing. These are the main sections that are found in every language. We hope, you've, we hope you have enjoyed VCU French, and if you have any issues or any questions, feel free to contact Madame Ede or Madame Abasekara. Or yourself. Or myself, yes. <laughs> Thank you so much for listening, guys. Um, and uh, we hope you get to choose French and enjoy your study here at Hampton Park.